After taking a day off, Hillary Clinton is back on the campaign trail today. This is a live look at an event happening at Commerce City, Colorado. The Democratic presidential nominee expected to speak at the crowd in just a matter of minutes there. Well, forget Hillary. Donald Trump is going after his own party. And now even President Obama is weighing in with a message to Republicans. Craig Boswell reports. Donald Trump held a town hall meeting in Daytona Beach, Florida, and immediately downplayed reports of conflict within his campaign. Right now, it's the best in terms of being united that it's been since we began. Trump's been under fire from members of his own party after refusing to endorse fellow Republicans, including former nominee Arizona Senator John McCain and current House Speaker Paul Ryan. On Tuesday, Trump told the Washington Post that he likes Ryan, but said the country needs very strong leadership and that he's not quite there yet. Today, Trump's running mate made it clear to Fox News that he is there. I strongly support Paul Ryan, strongly endorse his reelection. He's a longtime friend. He's a strong conservative leader. President Obama has already sounded off on Trump, calling him unfit to lead the nation. Today, the president's spokesman countered Trump's charge the upcoming election may be rigged. Uh, I would just note that it is often uh, a claim made by people who don't end up winning elections. Trump's Democratic rival Hillary Clinton toured a company in Denver which makes Clinton campaign ties and questioned why Trump brand ties are made overseas. If he wants to make America great again, he should start by making things in America. Earlier, Clinton's campaign filed paperwork to form a transition team fund. Craig Boswell, CBS News, the White House. A top Republican fundraiser and donor says she will endorse Hillary Clinton for president. The CEO of HP, Meg Whitman, says Republican nominee Donald Trump's, quote, demoguery has undermined the fabric of our national character, unquote. She says national security would be in danger under a Trump presidency. Whitman ran unsuccessfully for governor of California in the year 2010.